Hi, I'm Mike from the UK. I have my own channel where I focus on Arabic language and travel in the Middle East. And today I'm here on the EF channel guest vlogging. Today I'll be talking about life in Dubai and why you might like to choose Dubai as a city to study in. I'm from the UK but I've lived all over the world, most recently in Dubai, a world famous city in the United Arab Emirates. I think Dubai is a great place to live so let's go ahead and talk about why. Dubai is home to the tallest building in the world. It's called the Burj Khalifa and you can climb it. You can buy a ticket and go up and look inside. And I'll tell you what, when you go up, up to the top, you won't believe your eyes. The view from up there is just simply incredible. It's, it's a really fantastic place to visit and to see. And that's just one of the many things to see in Dubai. You can also visit the Al Fahidi Historical District if you fancy something a bit more cultural. So this is a place where you can go, you can dress in the, in the local Emirati dress and you can wear the kandora uh, or the abaya or whatever you, you, you fancy to try on. And the people there are really, really helpful and they will be able to talk to you about the history of the UAE and they really enjoy to share their history and their culture with you. So I'd recommend doing that as well. The Palm is a very famous landmark in Dubai. It's a man-made structure. Uh, which is kind of like reclaimed ground which sits out to sea and you've got buildings you've got hotels you've got apartment blocks and this is a really stunning place to visit and i recommend you take a taxi or, or maybe even a bus there and just go and see it with your own eyes there's a huge hotel called the atlantis hotel right at the end of the palm and that just to go and see it even if you don't go in it is a really really fantastic thing to experience there are lots of malls in Dubai and Dubai is, is partly famous for its malls. We have the Dubai Mall which is home to a huge indoor aquarium and you also have the Mall of the Emirates which is a, a, a few miles um, further south and that's home to an indoor ski slope. So you can actually go skiing inside the mall in an indoor ski slope which is kind of crazy when you think about it. Not far from the Mall of the Emirates is JBR, Jumeirah Beach Resort, and that is a really fun place to hang out, especially in the winter when the temperatures aren't too high, you can go there. And there's often lots of events, like you get people doing stunts and, and gymnastics, and there's performances, there's often lots of live music, and it's a really nice place just to go, have some food, and there's lots of restaurants there, lots of bars, and you can go and relax and spend time with your friends. So I'd recommend visiting all of those places we've just very briefly talked about. But honestly, there is so much more in Dubai. I just want to give you a short idea into, into the kind of things you can expect if you decide to come and study here in this city. Now, the official language of Dubai is, of course, Arabic. So since I am an online Arabic teacher, why not uh, let's learn some Arabic together. So I'm going to teach you two things to say hello and how are you. Now these are really easy and to say hello all you say is marhaba, marhaba. It's written like this, marhaba. And that's a, a, a really casual greeting just to say to anybody that you meet. You don't need to change it for male or female, marhaba. That means hello. Okay, so you can say that to any Arabic speaker that you meet in Dubai. To ask how are you, you can say kef halak. And you can say that to a man, to a female, you say kef halik, kef halik. So tiny little difference, but kef halik and kef halik. So if you can learn these two words, these two short phrases, then I think that will really help you just to get started uh, when you arrive in Dubai and you will inevitably meet some Arabic speakers there. Marhaba, kef halik, kef halik. That would be a really great thing to, to learn and, and to practice whilst you're in Dubai. I hope this video has given you an idea about what life in Dubai is like. For more videos about Dubai and about the Arabic language, you can check out my channel which is linked in the description. Thank you for watching. Okay, up we go!